Hey guys, Kefmaster2000 here, and welcome to episode 16 of Expanding My Collection. And, uh, we're gonna start off with Bridesmaids, which, uh, I mentioned, uh, in the previous episode that I had bought it, and then, and it was, uh, on its way. So, there it is. And then, uh, I also mentioned that, uh, the next things that I hoped to buy were these, um, these different... Uh, collections of old movies and uh, I have bought those and so the first one is the golden age of musicals 17 classic films which uh, includes career girl the duke is on uh, the duke is tops royal wedding something to sing about uh, all american co-ed the inspector general people are funny Second chorus, the fabulous Dorsey, Dorsey's, I, I don't know, um, the Pied Piper of Hamelin, till the clouds roll by, Pato Gold, Road to Bali, I'll talk about that in just a second actually, um, Stage Door Canteen, Private Buckaroo, This is the Army, uh, and At War with the Army. And then, here's all the discs. And then, uh, paper telling you about all the movies. Now, Road to Bali. I, uh, I also have another copy of that movie in a, a different collection. Um, it is in worse condition. Uh, the quality, the picture quality is in worse condition than this one. This one looks a little bit better, but still not great. Um... Because it's, uh, you know, a public domain thing now, apparently. Um, but, so there are a bunch of those Road 2 movies, and I plan on getting them soon. There's a four-movie collection that includes the first four. And then I'll have to get uh, the, the fifth one, Road to Rio, separately. And uh, Road to Bali is the sixth one. Um, now, there is a two-pack that has both of those, so I'll probably get that. And then, um, the last one, the seventh one, is Road to Hong Kong, which is harder to find for some reason. The, uh, DVD is, um, it's not as cheap. Like, the other ones are around, like, about ten bucks or so. Um, but for some reason, the Road to Hong Kong is, like, fifteen to twenty bucks, so... Um, I don't know why it's more rare, uh, but I believe, uh, Rio and Bali are both public domain movies. I don't know about Hong Kong, though. Um, all three of them are on YouTube, but, uh, for some reason, the DVD is, uh, harder to find for the Hong Kong one. Um, but I do want to get all those soon. Um, so yeah. Next up, we have this 20 movie collection which uh matches a horror movie collection that i have uh as well um so this 20 musicals made in the exact same style as the horror movie collection um that i have so this one includes it's all columbia pictures movies so we got uh music in my heart you'll never get rich tonight and every night down to earth miss sadie thompson my Sister Eileen, uh, Time Out for Rhythm, which is also in my Three Stooges collection, uh, movie collection, um, in the big, it's in the big box of Nook's collection in the, uh, the, the, uh, DVD collection, uh, the movie collection that comes with it, I cannot speak. So, the big box of Nook's collection for Three Stooges includes three different DVD cases, Three different collections together in one box set. One of those movie collections is a six movie collection, which uh, includes Time Out for Rhythm. Yes, that's yes, that's what I meant to say basically. Um, three for the show: Rock Around the Clock, A Song to Remember, The Five Thousand Fingers of Doctor T. Okay. Um, Let's do it again. Carolina Blues. Slightly French. You can't run away from it. 
uh, Hot Blood, and uh, then Idol on Parade, The Heat's On, and for some reason these two westerny, I guess, movies, um, Saddles and Sand, uh, or I was going to say Sandbags, um, Saddles and Sagebrush, and then Bonanza Town. Um, then we have this eight movie collection of wartime comedies, which includes Buck Privates, uh, In the Navy, Here Come the Waves, uh, Hail the Conquering Hero, uh, Caught in the Draft, Francis Joins the, uh, W-A-C-S, I, I actually have no, I, I, I am fascinated with history and everything, but I, for some reason, don't even know what that means. Um, I need to read up more on World War II, I guess, because, uh, I don't know what the wax is, or uh, W-A-C-S, um, don't know what that stands for, but anyway, uh, The Private War of Major Benson and The Perfect Furlough. At least I know what that word is. Um, then, uh, a war collection. Ten movies. Uh, we've got The Eagle and the Hawk, The Last Outpost, Wake Island, um, uh, Bengal Bri Brigade, uh, Bengal, I don't know what, how that one's pronounced, To Hell and Back, um, Battle Nim, I guess, or no, that, I, that's an H, not an N. Um, Heim, I don't know how that's pronounced at all. Um, that's a weird looking word. From here, from this distance, it kind of looks like an N, but it's an H. Uh, and I don't even know how you would say H-Y-M-N. Um, Heim, I don't know. Jet Pilot, uh... In Enemy Country, and Raid On, uh, R Rom Romel, I don't know how that's pronounced either, um, weird words that I've never heard in my life, so, yeah, um, next up we have this, the final one, 10 movies, uh, classic westerns, which I don't even care for westerns, but I got it because it matched the other three, um, so we have the Virginian, Texas Rangers Ride Again, The Spoilers, uh, When the Daltons Rode, Albuquerque, Whispering Smith, um, Com Comanche Territory, I guess, Syria, Kansas uh, Raiders, and Tomahawk. Some of these words I do not know. Um, so I struggled to pronounce them. And there are two reasons for that. One, I just don't know the words. Um, and two, I also just woke up. So, yeah. Um, <clears throat> that's my excuse. Um, but there are some words I've never even heard of before. I'm going to have to do some Googling. Um, so that is my collection of movies I bought recently um I have one more thing left that uh I just bought recently um I think I mentioned in the last episode that I had watched the Tina Fey Amy Poehler movie Sisters and I wanted to buy that and I have bought it but it uh has not come in yet but next on my list I have uh I mean, I already mentioned I want to get the Road 2 movies. Um, I love the Road 2 episodes of Family Guy, and I did not actually know that they were based on these movies. For some reason, uh, even though I love classic movies and classic musicals in particular as well, um, for some reason I just never even knew these movies existed. So I gotta get those, and, uh, um, I, I, uh, also found out uh, after watching the trailer for one of the movies, that the song Road to Rhode Island that they sang in Family Guy is a parody of a song that is sung in, I believe, Road to Morocco. 
the third one. Um, <clears throat> so that's cool. Um, so like I said, I want to get the Road 2 movies. But then also there's something else that I am thinking about getting. Uh, so yeah, I'll uh, just uh, wait to show you that if I, if I get it soon. Um, you'll just have to wait and see what it is. Uh, so, that is all for this episode. Thanks for watching.